having a data-driven culture is something that everybody strives to be, but it's very, very challenging. And when we peel the onion on that to see why is that? Why is it so hard? It should be so obvious. A lot of times, and especially in the line of businesses that I've been, I've been in the technology industry for a long time. Uh, a lot of people like to say, well, it's the tools, right? <laughs> we don't have the right tools. We need a new tool or, you know, it should be in there. Where's the easy button? Or there should be a workflow that solves this for us. Uh, there's other people who are like, oh, no, 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 it's all the processes. If we could just design a workflow that enables people to sign off on everything, I'm going to stop. How many of us have ever had a situation where somebody redesigned like our, our sales uh, solution or they redesigned your expense solution and all of a sudden you can't get anything done because there's an approval at every single step and you're just like, I get that we're trying to put controls in place. I get that there's governance, but this is not user friendly. I'll pause. Many of us have experienced that. That's when we try to overlay process on something and over process it. And it's like, ah, hashtag over engineered, not really working, not user friendly.